I was um, nearly crying on stage, not because I was sad, but because I just was picturing everything that this manifesto could change. I've met so many people that are crying out, not for tinkering around the edges of the system, but for, for fundamental change. The fact that in this country, some people can't feed their children. Imagine that on your soul, going to bed thinking my, my child has not had the food it needs today to thrive, to live a brilliant life. Imagine that. And there is so much hope in this manifesto. So much can change. And that is the reason we're being attacked. The reason we're being attacked is because the people who uh, are the richest in society, the people that wish to exploit workers, that keep people in horrible, filthy, damp conditions but make profits from their rent, they know that they are on borrowed time because they know we can deliver this. It is the most futile thing to do, but a clever trick really, isn't it? To concentrate on the personality of people, on what they like to do for hobbies, on what they wear, how they, how they dress, to distract people with those trivial matters when actually what people are saying, the policies that we are proposing, that the movement have actually written into this manifesto, when we know that can eradicate in work poverty, that can deliver a more peaceful world, that can go a, a huge way to stopping climate breakdown, they know that that's a distraction. So we have to ignore all of the people that want us to focus on uh, what we're wearing or what kind of personalities we have. Let's concentrate on the policies. This is the most brilliant manifesto. It will change most people's lives for the better. We're not going to worry about what people wear. It is so important that we have outlets like Double Down News. It is so refreshing to see a media that seeks to spread truth that seeks to give a platform of voices that aren't ordinarily heard. And now more than ever, please give them their support. In a time where fake news is rampant, we need Double Down News.